If you ever wondered why sailors use knots and nautical miles instead of kilometers, today we're going to talk about why. The metric system works really well when you're measuring straight lines and things that are square. But the Earth is round, and measuring things on a round Earth uh, with a square measuring system doesn't work all that well. But it works just fine for measuring the distance between two cities, you say. But somebody actually had to drive between these two cities and measure the straight line distance, which takes into account not only the curvature of the Earth, but also the hills and the corners. But it's not really practical to have somebody sail between every two conceivable points on the surface of the Earth uh, or every pair of islands. But thankfully, there is a better way. Because the Earth is round, it's common to measure positions on the surface of the Earth in degrees of latitude and longitude, where the equator is zero degrees and the North Pole would be 90 degrees. Now, each degree is further broken down into minutes, and there's 60 minutes per degree. Now, they've defined the nautical mile to equal one minute of latitude. This means the distance from the equator to the North Pole is about 90 degrees times 60 minutes, or about 5,400 nautical miles. Let's say we want to measure the distance from Hawaii to Marquesas. We take our dividers, we place them on the globe on, let's say, the big island of Hawaii to Marquesas here, and we measure the distance between them. Now, we transfer that exact same distance from the equator using the scale on our globe, and we find that there's about 32 degrees of latitude. We multiply 32 degrees of latitude times 60 minutes, and that gives us about 1,900 nautical miles. Pretty clever, huh? Now, we know that most sailors don't carry globes with them, but they do carry paper charts with them, and most paper charts do have a scale on the side uh, which corresponds to degrees of latitude, so you can do the exact same thing on paper charts. Most electronic GPSs also include a set of mini virtual dividers that you can put on two points, and it tells you the distance between them, using pretty much the exact same method. You can also take the coordinates of a location directly off your GPS device and uh, do the math yourself if you're so inclined. In terms of speed, a knot is simply the number of nautical miles that you can cover in one hour. Because knots and nautical miles are a really convenient way to measure things on the surface of the globe, they're also frequently used by airline pilots for the exact same reason. So now you know exactly why sailors and pilots use knots and nautical miles. It's because it's super convenient for navigating on the surface of a round Earth. Remember to leave a like, subscribe to my channel, and watch this next video.